where Thanksgiving's coming. We're going to have a lot of guests. Yes. I, I want him to help me yes. fill the dishwasher. Oh, provided and... he does it your way. Yes. Of course. OK. So I want help okay. for him. OK, so let's talk about dishwashers. How many people here, for show of hands, have arguments at home about how to load the dishwasher? So you look at this. Very, very <laughs> common problem. OK, let me show you how to load a dishwasher. This, my friends, is a dishwasher right here, just in case some of you have never seen one before. Um, the most important thing about a dishwasher is to imagine a sprinkler on your front lawn. Imagine a sprinkler sitting on the front lawn spraying up like this. It sprays out like this and straight up. If you imagine the inside of your dishwasher like that, it will help you imagine where to put things inside the dishwasher. Now, number one, before Thanksgiving, give the dishwasher a clean. The seals and the gunk trap are the most important thing. This little tray lifts out. The seals under here need cleaning. And in the bottom of the dishwasher, there's usually a tray. There's one right in the back here where all the gunk gathers. Lift it out and wash it out. Also, run the dishwasher, super hot water, one cup of vinegar a few days before Thanksgiving. It'll give the dishwasher a really good clean. OK, so clean the dishwasher. Let's start with glasses up top. Glasses go in the top rack. Do not sit them on the tines because the these little guys, these spiky bits are called the tines. Do not sit them on the tines, tines. Sit them beside the tines like that so then the tines won't leave stains or marks on the glasses. So that's pretty straightforward. Then... Oh. Hmm. <laughs> then... The, <laughs> hmm, that's my favourite part of the show. Then the bottom rack... Imagine that sprinkler on your front lawn. So you want these place to sit outwards, facing inwards, like this. So you put them, start on the outer and have the, the dirty side of the place face inwards so the water will spray out like that and clean the plates. Pretty straightforward. Bowls, top row, similarly. Start at the front, facing back this way, we need to get them sloping like this. Cutlery, pretty straightforward. Knives, blades down just for safety. For the rest, some up, some down, just so that they don't lock together and let the, lets the water move between them uh, most easily. If you have large serving spoons and so on that won't stand... Don't put wood in the dishwasher. Give me that. <laughs> <laughs> Under no circumstances put wood in the dishwasher. <laughs> Large thingies. These lay in the top. If they're spoons or that, obviously lay them face down so the water doesn't uh, collect in the spoon. Then uh, bowls. Large platters. I'm lo losing my mind. Large platters. Stand them on the sides like this. Again, so that they don't block the water flow and water can flow like this, and finally, bowls. Do not sit bowls flat in a dishwasher like this. It completely blocks the water. These also need to be sloping like this, so it lets the water move up and around the dishwasher. And last... <laughs> and, and most... most Seriously, I spent all my years at university to show people how to load the dishwasher. <laughs> did I say that out loud? Or did yes, I just you think, did. Oh, my God. Um, and the most important thing, look, it's Thanksgiving. Fighting over a dishwasher is absolutely insane. If someone wants to load the dishwasher, grab a glass of wine, go and sit in the living room <laughs> and let them load the dishwasher. <laughs>